You know what I like the most about Police in a Pod 3 episodes in? It's not just the jokes that kept on landing or the lovable cast of characters that we have here, but rather, it's the amount of experience and insight that we're getting from the author herself. I mean, being able to get cooperation from a kid and being able to praise one's commitment to caring for someone, which are skills that Minamoto and Fuji have respectively, right away I said to myself, that these skills aren't just there to characterize these two characters, but rather they arise from the author's experiences as a policewoman, which is then given to these characters to add more credibility to their designs. Things like these are what makes a story like Police in a Pod more believable and more worthwhile to remember unlike most anime. And quite honestly, my bottom line here is simply that the author of Police in a Pod has completely won me over and I have the utmost respect for her and the work she has made here. And one more thing before I end this review because I can't stress it enough but this show really deserves a bigger audience simply because it's just that good. And with that said, that's basically it for this episode. I thank you all for watching and see you guys next week.